Happy homecoming, Valparaiso. I'm your Storm Shield meteorologist, Adam Shawinski. Let's take a look at the forecast. There's another chance of rain on the way, but we also have a cool down associated with those rains. Now, this evening, if you're going out with friends, haven't seen alumni in a while, 1 o'clock, early, early this morning, late, late this evening, <laughs> it's kind of funny how that time works out, uh, you will see and feel that it's going to be nice out, 60 degrees for your low, 66 out in Pontiac, 67 up in Chicago, a nice night, really won't need a jacket, just a nice evening to sit outside, talk with friends, maybe get some dinner, a late dinner or something, won't be too bad out. Tomorrow after kickoff, 69 degrees in Valparaiso, 68 in Chicago, 74 in Pontiac, that's the really warm spot we're going to see here for the next few days. Sunday evening, 73 degrees at 845, so it will still be warm for a little while. Here comes that cold front coming through, 58 degrees in Valparaiso at 915 as you're making your way to class or away from, away from class. 53 as we hit Monday, 1130, late at night. That's when you're going to really tell the difference that a cold front has been here. Look towards the lake, at the bottom of the lake. You see those bright oranges, 56 in Chicago and LaPorte and Gary. As you get away from the lake, you can notice that we actually get cooler. Places like Logansport and Pontiac, you'll be much cooler than what we see out towards the, towards the lake. And that's because the lake will actually be warmer than what we see inland. So the air that's coming in is actually going to be quite cool and get us, knock us back down into the fall-like conditions that we should be seeing this time of year. There have been a lot of rainfall out towards our west into Wisconsin, Iowa area, Iowa area along the Mississippi River. They won't be getting any more rain. Hopefully that line will break up by the time it gets anywhere close. We'll be fine for tomorrow, 1145, right before kickoff, partly to mostly cloudy skies. But after, you know, your 3 o'clock game tips off, maybe you want to watch another round of football, that's when you might hear a couple of rumbles of thunder, especially if you're in central Illinois. And that's just going to all kind of move into our area. You can see that it kind of breezes right through Valparaiso. We might have one or two showers of thunderstorms tomorrow, a couple of rumbles of thunder here or there. Definitely some rainfall associated with this. But once we get past that in the evening hours, not only are the temperatures going to start to drop, but early morning hours, you'll actually get more sunshine as we go into our beginning of our work week. So for tonight, 59 degrees, partly cloudy to clear skies. For tomorrow, 81 degrees and a chance of thunderstorms, especially between 3 and 9 o'clock is when the best chance for those storms to have happened. So if you want to have some family activities outside, the best time to do it would be before the mid to late afternoon and early evening hours. So looking at our seven day forecast, what you're going to notice here is, yeah, there's a chance of rain tomorrow, 81 degrees for our high. But look at that, right in the middle of our work. The work week's going to be beautiful. Monday all the way to Friday, sunny skies every single day. While it is a bit cooler, we do have no chance of rain up until we get to Saturday for our weekend. Now, you're probably watching this on Facebook, or maybe you're not. You should like us anyway. You should like us not only on just YouTube, but definitely watch us on Facebook as well. You can skip that step of just going straight to Facebook. I'm your VU TV meteorologist, Adam Schwinski. Have a great rest of your evening, Valpo.